Namaskar. How are you all feeling today? I am Dr. Jayashree Sethi here. I have got a story and some fun learning activities for you. Are you ready for the joy ride? They say seeing is believing, meaning if you see something happening, you believe it to be true. Now the question is, how do you see or observe the world around you? You may simply say, I see the world through my eyes only. Now, can there be another way to enjoy the beauty of life? Let us watch this small video and find out. Panchangla, you are very quiet today. Did anything happen in the school? Yes, Eva, a new boy came to our school. He sits in our class. Yes. The teacher helped him sit in the front desk. He wears black glasses. He can't see. He will come every day. How will he do things? Finish your biscuits and milk, then we will play a new game. <laughs> yes, let us play. Now Tell me, what do I hold in my hand? How can I? My eyes are closed. I can't see. You can find out. Try it. What do I hold? It is something soft. A flower. Yes, but what flower is it? Smell it. It is a rose. Good. Now try another thing. What do I hold now? I know it is the bell. The small bell that gives such a musical sound. I can hear it, Eva. Good. Smart girl. What is it? What do I hold now? Do you know? It is a glass. A glass of water. Are you sure? It could be milk or juice. Oh, it is not water. It is orange juice. Good girl. Now, I will remove the scarf. You must tell what is in front of you. Oh, it is you, Eva. I see you. That was a wonderful game, Eva. So, on Shangla, if a child cannot see, there are other ways of finding out things. But the child may have some difficulties. I hope all of you will be friends with the new boy. Yes, Eva. That was on Shangla and her mother talking about seeing and feeling things around us through our five senses. Sight, of course, then smell, hearing, taste, and touch. There were some words that you heard in the story. These are sight words. Is, from, what, on, how, and, it, me, our, some, other. I loved the story and I believe you loved it too. The story taught me some new words. And these new words are quiet, 
when there is no noise, no sound around you, we call it quiet. F R O N T, front, when something is placed right in front of you, we say front. Sniff, when mama cooks something delicious and tasty, we first sniff it and if we like the smell, we love to eat it too. Remove, take something away if that thing is in your way or it is kept right in front of you and somebody take it away, we say remove. Joy, happiness, blink. When I open and shut my eyes very quickly, that is the time when we call it blink. Difficulties. We all face little, little difficulties in our lives. When we are going to school, when we are in a rush and we want to tie our shoelaces, we are in a hurry, we find it difficult. At times, when our teacher is dictating something, and we find it difficult to match the speed. So we face difficulties, little, little difficulties. But if we are strong and focused, we can overcome that. In this story, Anshangla called her mother Eva. If you ask me, I call my mother Ma. What is the word for mother in your mother tongue? Is it I? Is it Amma? Mai or Ba? And if you go to school, your peers, your classmates, they may be coming from different households. They may be speaking a different language at home. You may discuss this with them too. What do they call their mother at home? With this, we come to a close. Hope you enjoyed the story. Till we meet again, please take care. Bye-bye. Namaskar.